Hello there. Let's take a look at an interesting fact about Gmail accounts. I have a Gmail ID as seen in row number one year. Uh, this one, software trial 2015. Apparently in Gmail, uh, the use of periods is optional. So if someone was to send an email to me to any one of these three email IDs, all of them would end up coming to the same account. In fact, what's even more interesting is you could even send an email ID by adding something after a plus sign. Uh, Gmail basically ignores the plus sign and anything after that. So basically it would just ignore this and uh, send the email to whatever is until the plus sign. Here is a quick look at the same. Uh, I'm sending an email to plus one plus admin and the same email address without any periods. Let's send all three of them and uh, you will see that all three of them have come through. Uh, this is very helpful when we are trying to create accounts somewhere for test purposes. For example, uh, taking a look at one of my favorite live chat softwares. Uh, if I wanted to create two accounts here, I could use the same Gmail ID. All I need to do is add a plus admin and add a plus agent. And uh, that would give me two separate accounts, uh, but using the same Gmail ID. Keep in mind that you cannot use the plus sign while creating the account because uh, Gmail allows you only to use letters, numbers, and periods, but apparently those periods are irrelevant. But you know, uh, you could use them uh, just while creating the account. For example, first name dot last name, right? Uh, but uh, that's as good as creating without the period. Uh, hopefully uh, that was a helpful tip for you. Thank you very much.